Welcome to Unit Circle's Survival Guide. Today we're going to look in a, at finding the exact value of tangent of 3 pi over 2. And usually I like to use the SARC method, but I think it's important to notice that the angle that we're trying to find the tangent of is a quadrantal. And once you know what a quadrantal is, you'll really like these exact values because they are so easy and simplified. We really can simplify SARC to just the first and the last step. So I like to call it S and C for quadrantal angles. So let's see what this looks like. First, we're going to sketch the angle. So we'll sketch its terminal side. Um, then we'll find the coordinates and calculate. So we'll find whatever trig ratio we are looking for. And remember in this case, we wanna look at tangent of three pi over two. So our angle is positive and in radians. So we're rotating counterclockwise since it's positive. And we'll count zero, pi over two, pi, 3 pi over 2. So this quadrantal angle on our unit circle is going to be on the negative part of the y-axis. And so now we can easily find the coordinates. Remember we have it centered here on the origin. The radius of the unit circle is 1. So moving from the origin down 1, our coordinates are just 0, negative 1. And now we can calculate the trig ratio we want, the tangent. So the tangent of an angle on the unit circle is going to be calculated by the ratio y divided by x. So here, if we try that calculation, we have our negative one is y divided by zero, that's our x. So here we have a big red flag, of course, we can never divide by zero. So the tangent of three pi over two is going to be undefined, okay, or u and d to abbreviate. And if you are familiar with the graph of tangent, um, you know that when an exact value is undefined, we'll actually see a vertical asymptote there. So that's a nice connection to make as well. All right, so that's all there is to finding the tangent of three pi over two using the simplified SARC, the S and C method for quadrantals. Um, be sure to check the video description for links to more worked examples and other uh, options for help. Thanks for watching.